one is step equations. Solving an equation means finding the value of the variable. To solve a one step equation, you just need to do one mass operation. One mass operation means just operation like addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. Let's take a look at these examples. So these are one step equations. It says the first one, 5x is 25. So x, 5 times a number, the answer is 25. So we need to find the value of this variable. So what is x? So to solve the equations, we need to use the inverse operations. It simply means if here we have multiplication, then we need to divide. And dividing means dividing both sides of the equation. So 5 times a number is 25. We want to find that number. So you just need to divide both sides. This side, divide it, just write it over 5. And do the same thing for the other side. 5x divided by 5 is actually x. These two cancel out. 25 divided by 5, the answer is 5. So division is the inverse operation of multiplication. Let's take a look at the next one here. It says 6 equals to 14 plus x. 14 plus a number is 6. And it's actually here is added. 14 is added to a number. So we need to use the inverse operation of addition, which is subtraction. We need to subtract 14 from both sides. When we say both sides, means that this side and this side of the equal sign here. So minus 14 here and minus 14. 6 minus 14 is negative 8. 14 minus 14 is just 0. So these two cancel out. So x, one side of the equation, equals to negative 8. You can check your answer. Let's take a look at here. We can check it here. 6 equals to 14. And x is negative 8, right? Plus negative 8. Is that true? Are these two sides equal? 6 is 14 plus negative 8 is 14 minus 8, which is 6. So that is correct. 6 equals to 6. Next one. 19 minus x is 15. What is the value of x here? So 19 minus x, or x is uh, 19 minus a number, you get 15. What is that number here? That number is, it must be 4. So 19 minus a number is 15. 19 is minus 4. The answer is 15. Next one here. x minus 8 is 28. So what is x? Here we have subtraction and the inverse operation of subtraction is addition. So let's just add 8 both sides. 28 plus 8 is 36. And x minus 8 plus 8, these two cancel out. It's just x. And x equals to 36. If you check the answer, 36 minus 8, yes, it is 28. Next one. 20 minus x is negative 19. So 20 minus what number? It should be 19 more than 20. Why? Because you get a negative 19. So 20 to be minus 19 more than 20 is 36. So 39 is 39. So 20 minus 39 is negative 19. So this number must be bigger than this one. How much more? 19 more. Next one. x minus 17 is negative 34. So here we have subtraction again. So the inverse operation is addition. So just add 17 both sides. Negative 34 plus 17 is negative 17. And these two cancel out. X is negative 17. And if you check the answer, negative 17 minus negative 17, the answer is 
negative 34.